Hey, you might be wondering what I'm doing standing here in this field, but this field has a bunch of rare BMWs and we're gonna take a walk around and we're gonna walk our way over to one rare car in particular, really, that's uh, not a common sight. So let's go ahead and come with me. All right, everybody, so let's go ahead and just walk through these cars here. As you can see, we have a field full of cars, BMWs, parked in a giant field. So basically, what are you looking at here? Uh, this is the annual BMW Motorfest. It's a BMW CCA club member event that happens every year where hundreds of rare BMWs show up to a farm and park in some grass and it's actually a pretty cool event and so the car that i want to show you is up here on the left that we're walking towards it's a very rare car that uh, many people may have never seen in real life or in person and it is the iconic bmw z8 and what this is is this is an example of bmw producing basically a low production supercar from the early 2000s uh, what they did here is they took the power plant from the m5 of that generation and then uh, used the iconic styling of the bmw 507 from the early 50s uh, to turn this into a winning recipe for bmw um, which this car was built during what many people consider BMW's golden era of design, which was the early 2000s. And so this car started with a sticker price of around $125,000 back in the early 2000s, which even to like current times, $125,000 is like pretty hefty for a car. Um, so as we walk around it, some also iconic features about this car is that it was featured in a 007 movie called the world is not enough and this car was sawed in half in that movie so if you're interested in seeing that uh, you can look it up on youtube i'm sure but uh kind of a funny thing here is that bmw flipped the script on the bond movie name and instead of uh the world is not enough bmw did not build enough of these cars for everybody they only built 5,700 for the entire world, and then they only sent 2,500 of them to the US, U, U.S. market. So um, for the rest of this video, we're going to keep walking around and looking at a bunch of other rare cars. And up here we have some rare M5s, but I'm just going to cue some music and you can view the cars. Mm -hmm. 